Charlie, he just bought his first car, I believe. So now he doesn't have an excuse to... Not drive. Yeah. <laughs> That's the thing about Twitter, too, right? Twitter made like a huge comment about how like some Smashers just don't drive in general. Charlie says, you know what? I'm not going to be that Smasher that doesn't drive. I want to drive. Yeah, man. Driving is freedom. I thought it was just an L.A. thing. Like, you don't need a car if you're in L.A. or whatever. But I apparently it's, like, everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> when I uh, turned what, what percent of the PGR knows how to drive, folks? <laughs> That's not real. Hey, I'll give MK Leo the mistake. I'm sorry, uh, not the mistake, but, the like... The benefit of that? The benefit of the doubt, man. He's not from this country. <laughs> like, he, he probably... I don't, I don't know what the dri driving age for Mexico is. Me so either. I don't know about that. <laughs> Get your driver's license today. It's not that hard. There are websites dedicated yeah, to help you Honestly, get it early because once you're an adult, it's a lot harder to get it. It is. Like it You is. just don't have the time to do it if you have a job already, in not, my opinion. Not only that, the insurance. Yeah. The insurance. Yeah. You know, who, you know who got his driver's license early? Who? The Cooper Boys. I'm telling you, <laughs> they, they were smart. Yeah. License, license to kill. All right, Definitely. here we go. Now catch up, uh, just uh, just barely shy of the of the PR here in SoCal, yes. but immediately after he beat Cosmos at a Wednesday night fight, so yeah. that's uh, that's the story sometimes. So let's see how both these players are gonna do. It's gonna be very interesting. Ketchup has always been a player that is very shy off being PR, but that never dislodges the fact that he's such a dominant threat in the pools. Yeah, for sure. Like anybody can see the name, they'll recognize it here in SoCal. That's a player that can definitely cause an upset. Oh, good parry Ooh. from Charlie. He's not yeah. going to give him time to go for that cross up back air. Oh, and he says, I'm sorry, but you extend your hurt box. When you go for that up, Quilling does leave himself vulnerable. Yeah, it looked like uh, just from the way that Ketchup was facing. Oh, okay, there we go. That's going to be the kill. It looked like Ketchup, the way he was facing, he wanted to up B reverse, go past him into the hammer, but that didn't quite work out the way it did. It, instead, uh, he just got interrupted by down smash immediately first. But here we go. Five, six up airs in a row. That up air is pretty nutty if you think about it. Yeah. That wand has a lot of magic to it. There's a reason why players tend to take a couple aerials from it. Yeah, bring back the hammer, though. That was the, that was the best part. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Kamek doesn't mind letting the kids wild. It's magic wands. <laughs> yeah, but uh, just as equally, uh, Wolf can get some pretty good combos themselves and keep the damage at a even pace here. Yeah. The gotta damage, be careful at the ledge. The damage output from Wolf is really, really fast. It's also very strong. A lot of knockback. Great opportunity to go for that forward smash. Trying to give a little bit of a mix up here against Ketchup because he knows he's chasing him down. He wants the whip punish. Trying to call out possibly the early Koopa card. He didn't quite clip there by the forward smash. Okay, there we go. It's a side B conversion. Nice. He's trying to react the minute he went for the up B. Yeah, not quite able to get the timing on the two frame there. Nice, he went for neutral air. Last in hitbox. Definitely would have caught the neutral get up and the jump get up. Ooh, I think he was waiting for Ketchup to do another attack and then up smash out of shield, but it didn't quite work the way he wanted to. Ketchup was ahead of him, ahead of him and decided to go for a grab. Man, now these two giving up their second stock here. Being on the last stock in the first game in a best of three, definitely and not a position you want to be in. Yeah. Starts to get a little bit nerve wracking here, and Charlie holds on the shield. He tries to get a fourth kill. He tried to get a new chair, but catch up here will finally come back from the ledge. All right, he's got the angel platform invincibility. Let's see, try to close it out with something. Not quite. I like that. Uses the Koopa card to try and extend himself in the air, but just keep himself outside Charlie's range. And man, these two are going stock for stock on this one here. Only the first game. That goes to show, right? Ketchup's ability to be that close to the level of PR in terms of strength and damage. A uh, couple of empty hops gets the forward air. He puts Ketchup right back off the stage here. I like the fact that he keeps that forward smash as a looming spirit. If Ketchup does overextend with the Cooper card, he can't do the punish from that. All right, that neutral air doing wonders for Charlie right here. Just beating him out into air to air. Tech oh. chase scenario. Nope. Oh, but the forward smash, that'll do it. Charlie pretty much mastering the timing on the forward smash. Yeah. Catching the neutral get up. Oh, Very nice stuff. He's going to take game one. Charlie's always been one of those players that is never afraid to actually just lab out those little niche moments that they matter the most, those combos that you never expect, that you never see on a Twitter clip or from a top player. And Charlie is also very, very, he has a great work ethic when it comes down to mastering the game. And like you said, right, he knows the timing of the neutral get up to go for forward smash. So for him to have it mastered down in this situation here against Ketchup means he'll take game one.
Alrighty, let's see what Ketchup decides to go back to. Yep, just going back to Wolf. Alrighty. <laughs> Do you see how fast he pressed start right as soon as Charlie picked Wolf? <laughs> it was like, boom, 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 let's go back. I need to keep my momentum up. I know Ketchup also has a K roll, but he went out uh, for MSM this, this week. Yeah, that's not, that's not happening. <laughs> I, I, hope, I hope he doesn't do that. That's not happening, dude. As much as I, I, I want to believe in the K roll buffs, as much as the next K roll main, that sh probably shouldn't happen here. I don't even believe in the DK buffs. We lost by MCA. I don't even believe in the puff buffs. We lost Hungry Box. Yeah, probably not enough still. Yeah, like, man. The caliber of the brokenness of the other t top tiers is, is too much, man. Anyways, here we go. Get the grab. Another. I, I like how Charlie decides to go. For some reason, it just looks like he likes to go for upward conversion instead. So instead of like going for like down throw tech chase, he likes to go for up throw, uh, up air follow ups instead. Sounds very, in sounds very reminiscent of when he used to meet Bayo. Oh, yeah. He loved going for those combos. Get it in the back air. Oh, I like that. The high recovery, it stalls him in the air and then he goes around that cannonball. Very nice uh, mix up from Charlie. Nice. Doesn't, doesn't get the two frame one here against Bowser Jr. I'm sorry, Cooper Wing, but back air. Charlie still surviving with great day. Using the directional air dodge to make sure he loses his box away from the blast out. Yeah, straight up, I thought he was dead. Like, that looked like some whack DI. Oh, oh untackable there. Unfortunate. The two frame opportunity for Charlie, but he's unable to get it here. Ketchup will try to definitely get this extra cut at 140%, but none of the will matter when you get hit by the Wolf Flash. Yeah, it's really hard to calculate when you get hit by it, too, because the way that Charlie pulls it off is just instantaneous. Yeah, I mean, he hasn't—he barely uses uh, Wolf Flash to recover, and that time it looked like uh, Ketchup was trying to intercept another wolf, Fire Wolf, but it just didn't happen the way he wanted to. Oh, and he got spiked. Wow. Ketchup had the unfortunate opportunity to be below Wolf at the ledge here, trying to get him off the stage. Down throw. Jab won't be enough to kill yet. Maybe if he's at the ledge, he will. Definitely if he gets jab now, though. Oh, I, I told you. I told you. It's those little minute, like, combos that Charlie just practices against his... Against like on the stream every single time. Yo, that happens so fast. 